Hey everyone, it's Rachel and I am back again trying out another sheet face mask. I still don't know if these things actually work or not and that's what I'm trying to figure out. So this one is the pure, the Rejuvenate Purifying Charcoal Mask from Bath & Body Works. Um, you saw me try the other one um, that was like lemon um, a few months ago and now I have this so it just says apply mask to clean dry face avoid eye area after 10 minutes remove the mask um, and rub excess product into the skin so we're gonna see how this works um, so I'll take my glasses off and um, here goes nothing I am actually supposed to meet somebody for lunch later today so I hope this doesn't like stain my face um, but Oh well, if it does, I can just wash it, I guess. Okay. I'm trying to open it without ripping the mask. You guys, this thing is like... Ew. Oh, I hate this. I say this every time. This is disgusting. I have to wear this for 10 minutes? I don't want to do that. What have I done to myself? I can't even get it open because I like don't want to touch it. Oh my god, I thought I ripped it. Why don't they package these things, like, flat? Why do they have to fold them like they do? Like, I know it's to preserve it or whatever, but it makes it so hard to open it up without ripping it. I don't understand. I'm not in, gonna end up doing this right, and I already know that. So, here goes nothing. It's very cold. Now I just have to wait 10 minutes with this thing on my face. I'll check in with you then. Okay, it's ten, been 10 minutes. Uh, the flats keep going up my nose and I keep eating the charcoal strip because I didn't put it up high enough. So it's time to remove this thing from my face, finally. I'm just gonna throw this straight in the trash. Okay, and now the instructions said just to rub the excess into my skin, so that's what I'm gonna do. I don't have as much excess down here because it wouldn't stick. So my first impressions, um, it made my face really red. Um, second impression, it made my face tingle a little bit, so I might be lightly allergic to something that's in it. It does say that it's supposed to rejuvenate your skin, and I don't know if it's the extra product that I haven't rubbed in yet, or it's actually truly how it looks, but my face does feel lighter, like more glowing, 
but it could also just be excess slime. So, it's sticky. I don't like it. Um, but thank you so much for watching me try another face mask. Um, overall opinion, I enjoyed this one more than the lemon one, and I think it's just because I've tried the charcoal, um, like, put it on your face and scrub it off kind. So I'm more used to the charcoal one. And for me, it didn't get in my eyes, so that was another good thing. But I also put it down a little lower so like it didn't reach up here. So I don't know. It's hard to tell. Um, if you're interested in trying these for yourself, um, I got them at Bath & Body in the store. Um, they also have them online, I'm pretty sure. Um, and I think they have a couple different kinds, too. I just grabbed a pack. I got something for free and I'm like well why not um so yeah and let me know if you've used these in the past and if they work for you um a lot better than they work for me so thank you so much for watching and I will see you in another video bye